welcome back to civil engineers youtube channel in this video lecture i would like to guide you about reinforcement details for a 9 by 12 inches beam if you want to build your house and you don't know about the reinforcement details and the dimensions of 9 by 12 inches beam so watch this video till the end to know about new information related steel structure design assuming a simple residential or commercial beam which size is 9 by 12 inches depth is 12 inches width is 9 inches so how much steel is required this is not about the calculation i am guiding you for number of steel rods right so the first one is main bars bottom and top bars right bottom and top bars means these are bottom bars and these are top bars top bars are called compression zone this is compression bar and the this is tension zone okay so bottom bars are called tension zone bars okay and this is compression zone the top one so we required four numbers of bars two at the bottom and two at the top right so bar diameter should be 12 millimeter to 16 millimeter but i am recommending you you should use 16 millimeter if you are using for if you are using four numbers of steel rods but if you are using 12 millimeter die of steel rods so i am recommending you use five numbers of steel rods three at the bottom two at the top so all bars diameter should be 12 millimeter if you are using 16 millimeter so provide four bars two at the top and two at the bottom and based on the load it's depend on the structure load so the structure load means self weight and also live weight of the uh, load specially which applied on the beam so therefore the next one is stirrups are shear reinforcement so now let me make a long section for this beam guys you can see this is column and here this is other column and this is beam guys you can see first of all it's depend on the span span between two columns suppose i have a 20 feet right so now let me guide you for longitudinal bars so guys you can see we have two bars at the top two at the bottom so now stirrups are called shear reinforcement so the shear reinforcement are these guys you can see these are shear reinforcement stirrups so use 8 millimeter or 10 millimeter for the stirrup diameter next spacing should be 6 inches center to center the spacing should be 8 millimeter I am recommending you 8 millimeter with the spacing of 6 inches center to center. So closer near its support, closer near its support at the distance of L by 4. Because we have more shear stresses near its support at the distance of L by 4. L by 4 means length or span between two columns divided by 4. So you will get the value of 5 feet. To the distance of 5 feet, uh, the closer near its support, wider in middle, right? Wider means you can increase up to 7 inches. Near its support, you can keep from five to six inches right so the last one is note this general estimate for an exact calculation the beam span length and also load of the structure design must be considered because we don't have any load here and we don't did not consider anything i am just guiding you if you want to build your house and that is about g plus one story so the size of the beam should not be less than nine inches by 12 inches most of the students, they know very well from the ACI and also from the IS code, Indian Standard Code and from American Concrete Institute. So if the size is 9 by 12 inches, so how much steel is required? So use four numbers of bars. If the dia is 16 millimeters, so four is okay. If you are using 12 millimeters, so five numbers should be used. Three at the bottom because this is tension zone. Concrete is weak in tension. So use more numbers of bars compared to at the top portion and two bars at the top. Okay. So now I am talking about the stirrup. So the stirrup dia should not be less than 8 millimeter or 10 millimeter, but 8, 8, 8 millimeter is best with the spacing of 6 inches. So the stirrup should be provided. Uh, closer near its support guys you can see the distance of l by 4 and wider at the middle and these specification which i've discussed the front of you we did not calculate any load and uh, any spin but just i guided you for g plus one story thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye